Introduction to Genesis. We would have many more questions than we do about our world and who we are if it were not for the first book of the Bible, the book of Genesis. The title, Genesis, means beginnings, and the opening words to this, the greatest story ever told, tell us that in the beginning, God created all things. He not only created all things, but from these ancient texts, we can listen to him interacting with all he made. Genesis records many beginnings, the beginning of the world, of family, of sin and evil, of languages and of the nations. Genesis begins the great salvation story of God's purpose and plan for his creation. Notice how God chooses one man named Abraham to become one chosen nation, Israel, that would be a light of salvation for all peoples. Moses was the human author of Genesis, but God directed his words. Notice how God intended the first several chapters to be a crucial summary of the origin of the world and its peoples. If one were to start from creation and then divide the whole Old Testament story in half chronologically, the midpoint would fall after about Genesis chapter 11. The rest of the story of Genesis tells about the lives of several major characters, Abraham, Isaac, Jacob, and Joseph. It also introduces us to the way God pursues and enters into covenants or promises with his chosen people pledging his loyal love for them, which serves to benefit all peoples.